Republicans, Democrats? Well, the answer is yes. Both parties are at fault for different reasons. Republicans come to this floor and will come to this floor today saying, we need unlimited military spending. And Democrats will come to this floor and say, we need unlimited welfare spending. And guess what happens? They compromise. People say Washington doesn't compromise. They compromise all of the time. That's what this debt deal, debt deal that's before us is, is compromise. But the compromise is always to spend more money. How do we know that? The debt deal that's been crafted by Biden and McCarthy is an unlimited increase in the debt ceiling. See, historically, when we raised the debt ceiling, it would be $100 billion or $200 billion or, God forbid, a trillion dollars. It was a dollar amount. This debt ceiling will go up till January 2025. How many dollars will be borrowed? As many as they can possibly shovel out the door. It will be how much money can you shovel out the door until January 2025? That's how much we will spend. Is there a dollar amount? No. How much can you shovel it out and how fast can you shovel it out? There will be no restraint from this debt deal. There is a pretense. There is a playing around the edges as if, oh, there might be a cut here or there might be a cut there. There are no cuts. Why? Two-thirds of your spending is entitlement spending. The on-budget entitlement spending is Medicare, Medicaid, food stamps, and other programs. They are called mandatory and no one ever looks at them. They go on in perpetuity. This is what drives the deficit. Who took them off the table? How come there's no discussion of this? Actually, Republicans took them off the table because they fear being criticized by the Democrats.